a rogue planetoid dubbed VATS by the initial Solarian Surveyor Team, entered the system approximately 10,000 years ago and was trapped in a decaying orbit around Rayengri. It is nearly the end of its slow spiral inwards. Earthquakes and cyclonic winds are increasingly common on Rayengri. Within a few hundred years, the planets will rip each other apart. Some Asari travel consortiums have already announced sponsorship of cruises to observe the spectacle. Well, let's see if we can do something before the spectacle actually happens. have on this planet. We have an anomaly, an overrun research outpost, and debris on the other side. So either way that I go, I'm going to end up hitting the, uh, the Geth outpost in the middle. So I guess I'll just go for the debris and we'll go to the Geth outpost and then we'll hit the anomaly afterwards. Well, this doesn't really seem like a uh, habitable planet. Wow, you can see the other planet coming down that's going to tear this place apart. Pretty neat to look at, though. So, um, I guess my theory of them coming down to destroy uh, habitable planets is kind of out of the works. I'm not quite sure why they uh, chose this particular area. Perhaps it just is uh, a place where they're working on uh, setting up Geth outposts to attack, and nothing more than that. Some seriously bumpy terrain around here. You are mine debris. You can actually see it there. Very tiny, but it's there. Well, we'll see if my um, new item is going to actually allow us to not be jammed in a second. Got some friction frictionless materials again and a kinetic coil. I don't know if we've gotten a kinetic coil before. What exactly does the kinetic coil do? Plus 5 damage and plus 20 weapon stability. Nice. It's actually a pretty cool item. We're really getting up there in money, I just noticed. Damn. Alright, it's over this way, I believe. But it's always nice to mark it on the map, so I'm going the exact right direction. Oop. Looks like we've got some minerals over this way. Drive up to the planet's surface in the sky. Eventually, we'll get there. I gonna have to drive back up or is it down here? I hope it's down here. It's going to be a pain in the ass getting to the Geth outpost one way or another. Even though it's technically not a Geth outpost, it's a research facility. I will survey this while standing on it. Thank you, Thorium. You are now in my pack. I guess this shouldn't be too hard as long as we're mostly smooth going up this trail here. I don't know if this is the trail we were meant to go up or if there was another one. But this seems like this is a pretty good pathway to getting up here. Mm, there's probably another one because this is uh, opening on to nothing. I don't know if I can even get up here. worked out. Some beacons up here. Ah, I found the path I was supposed to go on. Makes me want to go down that path later on and make sure that there's no enemies down there. 
Don't want to miss out. Anyone up here? I think this is just a place to go into. A lot of geth spikes around here. Alright, well, let's do this. And since we're in close quarters, we might as well be using uh, close quarters weaponry. Watch your backs, guys. We have no idea what's in here. Man, there's tons and tons of lockers. Unfortunately, they all seem to be empty. Let's see if there's any that are actually not empty. Hey, there's something. Whoops. Went a little too fast. Aw. And not fast enough with that one. <laughs> Still made it. Raptor assault rifle. Sniper rifles. Alright, let's see if we've got anything new in the assault rifle stuff. Nothing that looks like it would be any better. Snipers, not so much. Volkov is our best one, and it's not quite good enough. Man, it seems awfully quiet in here after uh, we were outside in that really loud planetoid area. Couple pistols and a shotgun. Shotgun is a no-go, and the pistol also seems to be a no-go. None of these are worth anything. Okay, unfortunately I think that's everything that we can get around here. Watch yourselves, everyone. We're about to probably take on some Geth. Well, at least in these close quarters I can make use of my powers. I smell trouble! Uh-oh. That's a husk. Uh, let's back off. Bag it up, everyone. And I think we're going to want quicker weapons than uh, what we've got. So far, so good. That's Anyone it. else in Bag here? Him and tag him. Is that really it? Just husks? Okay, that was kind of disappointing. Looks like there might be some more enemies in here, but not in this particular room. What is the uh, reboot phase for my pistol anyway? Duration is 16 and recharge is 45 seconds. That's uh, pretty quick. I've been wondering why it was uh, seemingly booting up so fast. It seemed inordinately fast. Do not see... Did one of you guys fucking open that? Why you gotta do this stuff to me? That's definitely husks. Come on, guys. Let's move back. I would prefer that we get the jump on them rather than the other way around. Come on. Everyone back over here. Take them on in a second here. Over there! And off you go. <laughs> Apparently he got frozen. Are you coming or not? Wow. I guess my lift hit him too, even though I didn't even see him. Think we're good, Commander. Pretty nice. I was not expecting that door to open. I was still searching for uh, any possible crates or anything. There's a med kit in here. I don't need that, though. Alright, well, I'm going to just say that there's nothing in here and move on. There's definitely some stuff around the side, though. Yeah! 
Whoa, 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 whoa. This was definitely an ambush. They are coming. Come on. Ooh, watch out. They've got a sniper. Definitely still a sniper out there. Longer. I think we're good, Shepard. All right. Let's see what we missed in these back rooms because we were ambushed. Anything good back here? I think there may have been. Nope. There is actually something back here. <laughs> Nothing because it was just a uh, just something for them to ambush us is what I was going to go at, but. Doesn't matter anymore. So we've got a crossfire sh uh, assault rifle and a tornado shotgun. I don't think either of those are going to be any good. This Gemini amp might be helpful. Let's uh, check these things out. That's a pretty good weapon, the crossfire there. Uh, tornado, not so good. Gemini amp, not so good either, unfortunately. Not things that I want to use. Looks like there's one more thing back here. What have you? Kinetic coil. Don't think I really care. That is quite unfortunate. I was really hoping there was going to be a lot more gear back here. Maybe the other room will uh, present us with some good stuff. There's at least one malfunctioning object. Crate over here. Tiny crate. Striker pistol, tsunami assault rifle. I don't think any of that is any good. Well, there's a couple of things in here. Oop, four things. Razor pistol. And an equalizer sniper rifle. Let's check out the razor pistol. Not so good. Equalizer, okay, but I think mine's better, yeah. Certainly is. Energize Plating 9. What does Energize Plating 9 do anyway? 19 damage protection. Not very good. I was really hoping for something better than that. Firestorm Shotgun. We've got some heavy armor for human. No. Ashley doesn't deserve armor. She gets to sit on the ship forevermore. I wonder how good that, that heavy armor is anyway. It's not that great, honestly. It's kind of crappy. Well, I think that probably about does it. I don't think there's anything else in here to find. And I doubt we're going to get ambushed on our way out again. Possibly get ambushed when we go outside, but we'll see. We shall most definitely see. Well, it might have been a disappointing uh, haul of items, but technically I can use that to uh, sell, so that's not that bad. Enemy oh contact. boy. It's definitely uh, outside now. Danger Town. for this incursion. Hold on. This receiver's picking up some kind of transmission. Based on the signal strength, I'd say it's coming from inside this star cluster. It must be a message from the primary Geth base. We can use the signal to lock onto its location and take them out. It 
must be a message from the primary Geth base. We can use the signal to lock onto its location and take them out. Yeah, you, you already said that once before. You don't need to say it multiple times, Garrus. Trust me. We're fine. Alright. I wonder how close we are to a level here. Uh, we're a good distance off still. For a while here. Oh well. We're, uh, we're certainly getting much closer to uh, where I want to be. I'm going to go check down along all of these uh, beacons here and see if there's anything between all the pylons. It's a strange little alcove down there. that noise. Oh, it sounded like something uh, coming to life behind me. Huh. Okay. No idea. No idea whatsoever. it is again. I think that's just uh, a noise that happens as you go by there. Alright, anyway, we still have an anomaly to go after, so let's go and see what it is. Oh, hey. Some minerals down here, too. Good enough for me. Polonium. You are all mine, Polonium. Aw. You will be all mine momentarily. There we go. Let's get back to whatever this is. It's like a little satellite or something. Heading out. Escape pod. Ah, I thought I made that. Medallion recovered. This down pod contained a League of One medallion. Its owner is nowhere to be found. Let's see here. How much do we have left? We've got one Prothean artifact left, and uh, one League medallion left. Apparently, we found four of three ID tags for the Salarian stuff. Anyway, there's still something to find of uh, the Geth outposts, but before we do that, I'm going to check around and see if I can find some more minerals. So, I was just heading up over the hill when suddenly came across this. That looks like a crate down there. This is interesting. What do we have down here? Am I going to get ambushed or something? No? Watch out for Geth, guys. We've got Heavy Armor Mercenary 8. And uh, Cypher Tool 7. Let's see if either of those are good. The scavengers who made this camp are gone. They seem to have abandoned it abruptly some time ago. Interesting. Oh, apparently we picked up some ammo upgrade at some point. Whatever. Anyways, uh, we've got an armor, which looks better than the uh, Guardian that we picked up, but not much better. 